of now rising above and defying the odds. That's the story of one teen mother turned educator. WDSU reporter Ariel Brumfield sat down with the new head of St. Catherine Drexel Preparatory about returning to the school and her message to young women. Reclaiming what's rightfully hers. Congratulations, we're so you. glad you did. I know, right? Yes. Well, you coming back. I'm not only giving them back my experiences, but I'm getting, giving them back my talents as an educator. In the halls of the very school where she made one of the toughest decisions of her life just 32 years ago. Awesome. Awesome. Azula is awesome. The newest principal of St. Catherine Drexel Preparatory School, formerly known as Xavier Prep. And walking through the halls, I just had so many fine memories. Natasha Skidmore says this full circle moment is a realized dream. 32 years ago, in these halls as a, um, a 12th grade student, I became pregnant um, with my daughter, oldest daughter, she's now 32. And it was a you know all girl Catholic private school and there are rules and regulations. The burden was on me to, if I returned to school as a, um, a teen mother, I could not discuss that I, I had a, a, a child. You know, so there was other options to do, go through which the archdiocese um, required. And so my family and I, we just, you know, discussed it and agreed that I would just withdraw my senior year. Withdrawing in the middle of her senior year, Skidmore says becoming a mother came with sacrifices like not graduating with her peers and no longer attending Spelman University where she had a scholarship. Despite her circumstance, she says skipping college was never an option. My baby and I, we went on to college. I started at Dillard. Got my bachelor's at um, Southern University of New Orleans. Skidmore became an educator at 22 years old. She went on to get two masters from Xavier University, her postmasters from Capella University, and she's just short of her doctorate. 32 years later and enjoying retirement, she says she wasn't expecting to answer the call about becoming principal, but the mission is bigger than herself. But my goal coming back here is so emotional because this is where I started. So it's like full circle to me and to come back here and to be an example for the young ladies. School begins on August 10th and Skidmore says she plans to instill in her girls the mentality of high expectations, standards and succeeding above all odds. I wanted them to know you don't have to look for a role model because I'm the model. I did it. You can do it. I don't want them to give up. I know it gets hard, but at the end of the day, you have to focus on the prize. And I tell that to young ladies all the time. Keep your eyes on the prize. Great story there. Latasha Skidmore says that she looks forward to being a positive leader for students this upcoming year and working alongside alumni. And with the school year starting up, don't forget to head to WDSU.com for a full back to school guide. We have everything you need to know to start the new school year off right.